The 2017 Nigerian Chief of Army Staff Second and Third Quarter Conference afford participants from various Army formations and commands the opportunity to appraise training and operational activities undertaken during the period. The conference further enables the Army make projections for further conference and put the force in a better position to perfect its operational strategies in tackling emerging security challenges. Speaking after declaring open the conference, Chief of Army Staff Lieutenant General Tukubur Tai said the Army will continue to conduct more exercises to sharpen officers' skills and prepare them to tackle emerging security challenges across the country. He explained that the exercises were aimed at focusing personnel in real-time operational scenarios as against simulated training situations. Uh, this is just to reassure uh, Nigerians to assure law-abiding citizens that uh, the Nigerian Army and indeed the other security agencies are really concerned you know, with the safety and security of uh, their lives and property. And you are very much aware of the security challenges we are having. On the proscription of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, as a terrorist organization, Buratai explained that the Army had no plan to arrest the leader of IPOP. Nam De Kalu, stressing that only the federal government can take the decision. There are guidelines, you know, that, you know, it's provided in the Act, you know, on the uh, Anti-Terrorism Act, you know. So I'm sure the relevant government agencies and authority will take the appropriate step, whether to arrest, whether to do any other action, and we will receive the appropriate directive from the. The army chief noted that the army is not under any political pressure to withdraw its troops involved in the operation Python Dance 2 from the southeast. The Nigerian army is part of the political uh, you know, consideration in the democratic system. It is uh, uh, part of the you know, democratic process. It's a product of the democratic governance. You know, the military, you know, so uh, we are not receiving any uh, pressure. We are doing what Constitution, you know, has provided for us, constitutionally what our responsibilities are for us. So we are not under any pressure whatsoever. The Nigerian Army had come under public criticism after it relaunched the Operation Python Dance 2 following activities of the indigenous people of Biafra in the southeastern parts of Nigeria. Dominic Ayemese, ITV News, Abuja.